With its signature tandem rotors, the Boeing CH-47 Chinook helicopter is well known for its unmatched efficiency and reliability, having played a pivotal role in thousands of combat and humanitarian missions. But the aircraft, which just marked its 50th anniversary since first delivery, may never have taken off without the vision of a man named Frank, Frank Piasecki. The whole focus of his mind was on what are real world problems that need to be solved. Nicole Piasecki recalls her father's passion and perseverance. She says the aviation pioneer who invented one of the first helicopters while still in his 20s had a never ending desire to get it right to do it better. His mind just kept driving to new ideas, really focus on affordability, pragmatism, get the capability out fast. In the Boeing archives, aviation historian Mike Lombardi finds countless examples of Piasecki's prolific career. But it's the tandem rotor design, the same one on the Chinook, that really stands out. This dual rotor design helps the helicopter to fly to higher altitudes than other helicopters and perform in environments where other helicopters just can't go. For example, the tandem rotors allow the Chinook to be extremely stable in high wind conditions, while the rotor blade's placement gives more room to load cargo in unfriendly terrain. All the while, the aircraft can carry heavier loads than other choppers. What he loved most about the tandem rotor configuration was its ability to use 100% of the power dedicated to vertical lift, giving the helicopter, in almost all cases, an advantage in carrying payload in the hover. Piasecki says if her father were alive today, he would be proud of the legacy that lives on in the Chinook, including the many improvements. Over the years, Boeing has modernized the Chinook with new engines, a new fuselage, composite rotor blades, digitally enhanced flight controls, to name a few. The Piasecki says her dad would spend little time on the pass because there's more work to do. His advice? Keep going. Dad was very clear that he thought reinventing the wheel was a waste of time and money. He really was focused on how do you improve the performance of the product, how do you improve survivability and how do you make it more affordable? And I think that's exactly where the Boeing team is focused today.